what's up everybody welcome back to the channel um, I wanted to give you guys a little bit of updated dream uh, for my running for the year and I'm, I've been getting a lot of love from the why I run every day and I wanted you guys to see what's going on to this point as of today I have run 254 days and counting um, first of all I am loving running every day even though there's difficult days and then there's easier days um, I have run so far through the spring summer fall and now the winter so basically every season and I'm not going to lie the winter is my least favorite um, even though it is my least favorite I'm still motivated every single day to get out there to run um, getting out to run is one of those things that now if I don't do it I feel weird I'm not the same I'm not happy um, it's one of those feeling that I just need to get out of the way um, so my experience with the winter one thing I noticed right away was the fact that my lungs get inflamed really quick because I'm taking in cold air and I'm, I kind of adapted to it but it took a while and another thing that I realized is the amount of clothes that I have to put on just to keep myself warm I don't want to get hypothermia or anything you're sweating and then you're in the cold but I literally put 45 layers of clothes this is no joke I have my under armor I have a, a little soccer jacket like it's not a hoodie it's a zip up and then I put on a hoodie on top of that and a vest or a big sweater on top of that and um, I put on three gloves believe it or not because one of the things that gets cold easily for me is my hands my fingers always get cold and compared to the rest of my body uh, sometimes I put on leggings and then put on a pants on top of that or depending on the, depending on the weather I would only do the legging and shorts but um I've had a funny moment with my running in the winter there was a, a big snowstorm here in Jersey and I was running out I was actually having a decent time with it the snow was about I would say two almost two feet it was pretty high and I'm running around in the snow and I'm having a good time but I turned into this street where there was like a, a plow machine and also the wind was coming to my face so it was strong with the snow it was hurting I decided to pivot quick I was my eagle I was feeling myself I put my foot down and pivoted to turn around the other way next thing I know both of my feet foot slipped underneath me and I landed on my hip so bad it was painful but I never got up so quick in my life from falling down because a I was embarrassed that the plow machine people are gonna be laughing at me B I don't believe in running when you get to pause when you pause it doesn't count as a full run so I can't say well, I ran three miles but I took a pause for like 30 seconds that doesn't count so I got up real quick and the rest of my run I was literally cracking up the whole time laughing at myself and imagining that a uh, couple that was talking to the news reporter when they were saying that this was the best surface to run now when it was winter time and as soon as they turned around the lady fell down but um that was my one of my experience with running in the cold um, one thing though that gets me motivated no matter what is knowing that I've done so many days already So I'm like I came this far. Why would I stop and let me get out there and get it done? Um, one one of the things that I've noticed also is the fact that my time of running outside has decreased um, This has to do with the cold. It's not anything that I'm like out of shape or anything. It's just tough It's really tough anybody that runs in the cold you could probably um, have similar experience but this month been really strong with me the January month I've been actually running an average of 8.3 miles a day and uh, so I've completed so far this month um, 23 days in 192 miles which is crazy and I, it's one of those I felt like I was lacking a little bit in December I was, I was going but I didn't feel like I was getting that good amount of running that I needed to get out of myself um, I've also been running indoor actually so believe it or not my priority is no matter what for 365 days I gotta get outside and run whether it's hot raining cold whatever it is I'm doing that but also I have a gym membership that I go to uh, that I a gym that I go to so I will run outside but when I get to the gym I use the treadmill I don't like the normal treadmill there's a treadmill called the curve it's kind of like a as you run it will go to the speed it's almost like running naturally on the ground so it moves as your leg is moving um, so I run outside I make sure that that's the priority get that run done and when I get to the gym everything after that is extra so when I get on a curve I'll run about two miles on average um, minimum two miles and then sometimes I go over that so that also would add up to some of the miles I would run my outdoor miles and then get indoor and get a couple miles in also 
But um, that's been my experience so far in the winter. If anybody has any question or are uh, curious about anything that I've been doing with my running, please let me know. Leave me a comment or you can DM me on Instagram. My Instagram is hella good nine. Um, I'll be glad to answer you. And if you still have any recommendations on running in the winter, um, please let me know. Thank you everybody for all the love for my pre uh, for my previous videos and especially the why I run every day. Um, I really appreciate that and I hope you guys enjoy this one and you get a good view of me running um, from a, a good point of view actually. I was a, it was a decent pace and believe it or not this video wasn't just shot for me to do the running part. I was actually running hard um, for the pretty much the whole time. We're just I was just saying you know what. I'll just keep running and this would have been my second run of the day because I had already initially done my my normal running so we did this video and it became an extra running for me so it was a win-win situation uh, thank you guys again I hope to see everybody soon for another video enjoy this one take care